With its acquisition of local pump and part manufacturer Keto Pumps last year, US-based heavy-duty slurry pump manufacturer Shoko Slurry aims to continue to increase its global footprint. As such, Shoko Slurry unveiled its new one-piece cover plate liner at this year's Electro Mining Exhibition. Sabrina Jardim tells us more. Shoko Slurry MD Emil Fori commented that Shoko Slurry's acquisition of Keto Pumps has enabled the company to leverage its expertise and establish a bigger reach in the African market. He explained that this has, consequently, enabled the company to expand its offering to the Middle East and Europe as well. The benefit that we had with the, the acquisition was that it was really part of a global footprint and it really enabled us to just leverage what we've got and use the expertise and the, the staff that's already familiar with a global market and slot that into the Sherco vision and footprint. And it really enabled us to just grow that footprint even more. Fori explained that the one-piece liner ensures greater safety for pump installations and decreases liner installation time. Hence, he said the liner provides a simpler and quicker way to replace parts in a pump. The one-piece is mostly available on most of the ranges, but at the moment we've limited to the H6 HS pump with the objective of rolling it out across the range on all the pumps. And then in addition to that, we're looking to expand and to bring new materials to the market that we also want to approach and, and provide additional solutions for mining companies. Fori added that the product was developed in the United States and is being rolled out into the African market. The objective really is to introduce the polyurethane uh, mix to the rubber mix that we've currently got, just to give that flexibility from a technical perspective on the solutions that we want to drive to the clients. We've released it in the US market really over the last two years to test the product, to test the usage of it and how economically it's been running and that's been really successful over hundreds of clients and installations that we've already done. He added that the company also has other products in the pipeline. We're currently looking at the polyurethane range which we want to add to the rubber range. As far as we know nothing like that is currently in the market so that's where we're going to be uh, most of our focus. With Shoko Slurry continuously investing in new technology and in modernizing its product realization strategy, Fori said technology has allowed the company to become more competitive and to ensure that its products are of adequate quality. The technology is advanced through Shoko Slurry over time, investing quite significantly and changing from our two cat model to our free cat model to our fully assembled modeling and this is a finite element of the Sherco Slurry sort of enablement to provide and ensure that we give quality products to the client and value to the customers, ensuring that we test and we make sure that the quality that we built is what the client ultimately experience. In addition to this, we've really invested and we're investing more into ensuring that we deliver a life system enablement for clients and for the internal systems which is being based on an ERP system that goes live so that we can give clients access to what's going on into the value chain of delivering products to our clients. Fori explained that technology has also been beneficial for the company's operations. It's brought Sherco Slurry into the power base of slurry pump companies where we we can compete with the best out in the market, ensuring that not only do we provide a quality product, but we've also got the ability to use technology and leverage our staff and our technical expertise to deliver to the clients across the globe. And it's really enabled us to, to live to the values that we want to create by doing things right the first time and making sure that it's on-time delivery for the clients.